Hey everybody, Jason here. Good morning, good morning. Wednesday, we're halfway through the week. Rolls Royce looking pretty good. Made another 60 bucks on this today, up $630. Um, so this has this done nothing but gone up for me since I bought it for absolutely no reason. Um, that's just for fun. But let's get into how much I've been hacked today. So I have been hacked about $2,800 today. Um, everything is pretty much going to depend on what Jerome Powell puts out here in the next couple hours. Um, we expect to see some pretty huge market movements there. Um, and then no matter what the movement is, I kind of expect it to, like if it, if it drops to come back or if it pops way up to come back, um, just because I feel like it'll take a little while for the market to digest and then come back in the other direction. So, um, today, other than this, I wanted to show how we deal with our iron condors once they are, um, at a price where we want to close them out. So if I was paying better attention to this this morning, they only wanted like a dollar or $2 to close this, which would have meant I would have um, collected basically nine out of my $11. I could have closed this and then opened up another one um, using that same collateral for a little bit more money. But since I did not pay attention, we'll go uh, over how to open or how to close this and how to make sure that it goes, that it automatically closes next time um, the price of this drops down. So take a look at AT&T real quick. Yep, so still sitting around that 30 $30 mark. So to close an iron condor, we have two of them here. And what we're going to do is just hit trade and close. So simple as that, right? Um, so I don't want to close it at the current price. Yeah, we would gain three bucks. Um, so a total of $6, but I am fairly confident this is not going to hit, hit down to 27 or up to what was the high part of this? Uh, 32 in the next I mean, it probably won't hit those in the next months, let alone um, weeks. So when it does get down, I want to close this for $2. Um, $1, it would be super, super, super difficult to close just because the difference in the bid and the ask with two separate spreads, which an iron condor is making up a put credit spread and a call credit spread, uh, both at once. And... Um, yeah, $2 will be a little bit more reasonable to be able to get this closed. So obviously I'm not going to be able to close this today um, or right now because they're they're asking at least $4 minimum. And as you can see, like at the limit price, but in case it does hit it today or even in the coming weeks, what I'm going to do is go up to the upper right hand corner where you see the gear. I'm going to hit that and you can see you can hit good until canceled. It's funny that they use shorthand like that, good till canceled instead of good until canceled. But we just swipe that over. And that is all we need to do. So we entered our limit price. So it'll cost us $4 to close both of these. So, which means we collected our, we'll collect $18 total or keep $18 of the premium that we collected, closing it for two, um, four dollars total. So not bad for, you know, a few days or a couple weeks worth of work. Um, that'll be basically in eight, uh, or what would that be? 9% that we made on our collateral um, in the course of a few weeks. So let's hit review. Um, as you can see, we'll get our collateral back. Our collateral was no AT&T and $200. So that collateral, $100 for each of the iron condors will come back to our account and be available to do with whatever we would like. Um, it'll cost us four dollars to close this iron condor so who knows when this will happen but and that's all we have to do hit done and now we're all set um as time decays the surely will hit two dollars unless it happens to drop below 27 or above 32 all right guys if you have any questions on that that is that is super straightforward on that um let me know down in the comments and i will do my best to answer them other than that, I hope you guys have a great day. I hope Jerome Powell has some positive news for us as far as the market is concerned, but make a lot of money.